Hello. Today I'll be talking about movie review number 16, and this movie is The Mummy. This is the 1999 version starring Brandon Fraser and Rachel Weiss, and this is directed by Steven Summers. This was a very good movie. I saw this on June 28, 2020 at RJ Cinema in East Day, Ohio. Um, I'm giving this an 8.9 out of 10. It was very entertaining. I did see this movie before a lot of years ago, but never in the videos. The only Mummy movie I saw was the 2017 version of Tom Cruise, and that was in the Milford movie video. Oh, I like that movie too, but I'm, today I'm talking about the one with Brandon Fraser and Rachel Rice. So, this mummy movie does take place in Egypt. And so basically, without giving any major spoilers or anything, basically, a mummy is walked away in Egypt, and after several people and then reopen it, there was chaos. So, but go see the movie yourselves, guys. This is a really, really good movie. And good cast, good director. It was very, very good. And due to the success of this film, has read many sequels in the reboot. Like I just mentioned, there was a reboot starring Tom Cruise in 2017. But, there have actually been two sequels, The Mummy Returns, which also stars the Scorpion team, who is played by Dwayne Johnson, who got his own spin-off film a year later after The Mummy Returns came out. But, and then, there was a Mummy 3 called Tomb of the Dragon Emperor. Now, here's a little fun fact I just found out. There were plans for a Mummy 4 called Rise of the Aztec, but Universal decided to make a reboot of it instead. Even though I did write the reboot, I kinda wish they went ahead with Mummy 4, because if that would have happened, then Brandon Fraser would probably reprise this role along with some of the other characters from the Mummy franchise. But anywho, this is my movie review of the Mummy, very, very good. And I like the fact that it does take place in Egypt because I like seeing movies in different countries. It's very entertaining. And it explores different perspective with different countries on film. I like how they are I like how several movies portray different countries in a good way. So it's very really nice to see the Egyptian culture in this film. Along with, I think, the second film is also takes place in Egypt, and I think the third film takes place in China. I'll have to double check on that. But anywho, this is my movie review of The Mummy. Stay tuned for the next one, which will be about the Avengers. Goodbye.